Hey everyone, S2L Sydney Trains on location here. Uh, this video will be featuring trains during the Sydney Trains industrial action that occurred on Monday the 20th of December 2021, where trains were suspended on every train line on the Sydney Trains and New South Wales train link network for 12 hours between 6pm on the 20th of December till 6am on the 21st of December due to industrial action by the Rail, Tram and Bus Union. Uh, all trains were stopped at 6 p.m. So what we see in this video is I got to Oatley Station about 6 p.m. and filmed the final trains before the uh, shutdown. We also then head over to Mortdale and see trains being stabled in the Mortdale Maintenance Centre. Uh, yeah, the last train was really about 7, but uh, yes, trains started winding back around 6 and running to some interesting timetables and stopping patterns. So that's what we'll be looking at in this video. So if you haven't subscribed to Stoll already, make sure you do so. And I uh, hope you enjoy this video and uh, stay tuned. Kicking off with the Cronulla service into Platform 2. First stop, Janelli, then Sutherland and all stations to Cronulla. Waterfall service, T44 front half.
So with this industrial action, you can see the next train on platform two is a Cronulla service in four minutes, stopping Janali, then Sutherland, then all stations to Cronulla. Following train will be a waterfall in nine minutes, and then that will actually be the last train of the night due to this industrial action. And then over on platform one, the next train will be a Hurstville service in two minutes, and then a Sydney terminal via Walleye Creek service in 27 minutes. Now I will just say this Hurstful service is actually ex Port Kembla from the south coast. So it's a train that would normally run from Port Kembla to Waterfall as the local shuttle, uh, but it's continuing to Hurstful to reposition into the Mortdale Maintenance Centre uh, for stabling. Because uh, they're not stabling in at Waterfall, they're probably stabling in at like Mortdale or something. So they're continuing the service to Hurstful. So yeah, ex Port Kembla, four car Tangara, stopping at Oatley on a Hurstful service on platform one. Definitely not something you see every day. Um, I'm gonna catch this train over to Mortdale uh, and then I'm gonna continue this video at Mortdale because I'm hoping at Mortdale I might catch some train stabling in the Mortdale Maintenance Center. So I'm gonna catch this to Mortdale and then uh, yeah, continue the video at Mortdale where hopefully we'll get some repositioning going on. We got that four car Tangara about to arrive into platform one. This will be a Hurstful service. It came from Port Kembla and it will stop Mortdale, Penshurst and Hurstful. The set is P30. All the way to Hurstful this train will be going. Export Kembla, personal service. And as you can see, that's where it stops. All right, so I've just gone and caught this Tangara now from Oatley to Mortdale, the uh, Export Kembla Hurstful service. So the next part of the video will be the industrial action at Mortdale, where we'll see. Uh, trains heading into the Mortdale Maintenance Centre after they've terminated at Hurstville. 
So, uh, yeah, train stabling due to the industrial action. Here we go, as well as the final trains uh, of the day at 7 p.m. when it's broad daylight. Very weird. But, yeah, sit back and uh, enjoy the Mortdale action. Alright, I've just moved up to Mortdale, where, uh, yeah, this, this Hurstville service is departing for Kartangara, ex Port Kembla South Coast, T30 rear half. As I said, rare sight to see four car T sets stopping here at Mortdale. So, yeah, very cool sight. Waterfall service about to pass platform number two here at Mortdale. Its next stop will be Oatley followed by Como, Janelli, Sutherland, and all to Waterfall. Fun fact, this is the last Waterfall service of the day with the industrial action, and the last train of the day that will stop at Oatley and Como. T15 in the front half. And T50, the rear half. Something a bit different, 82 classes through platform one. They were stopping or not for a second. I thought they might have been stopping and doing a driver switch or something, but or someone might have been getting out a crew member or something, but nope. The next train to very arrive slow on platform two goes to Cronulla. First stop Janali, then Sutherland, and then all stations to Cronulla. Cronulla service into platform two. Stopping Janelli, Sutherland, all to Cronulla, T37. The train on platform two goes to Cronulla. First stop Janelli, then Sutherland, and then all stations to Cronulla. Five minutes, Central City Terminal stopping. P 
Penzurst, first of all, Walleye Creek, Redfern and Central. And there'll be one in 13 minutes as well with the same stopping pattern. That'll be the last two services of the day from Platform 1 due to the industrial action. We've got a Tangara passing Platform number 2. Train will be probably heading to Stable for the night due to the industrial action. T80 front half. As I was saying before, a lot of these trains will just be stabling now. Uh, as yeah, from 6 p.m. tonight, there are the trains are starting to wind up for the day. There's only three more trains supposed to stop here at Mortdale for the day. One going to Cronulla and two going to Central Sydney Terminal. off it goes. And there it goes off to be stabled. It's done its done its day of service. Getting an early mark. And we have a central Sydney terminal service now are about to arrive onto platform one. First stop, Penzers, then first of all, Walleye Creek, Redfern, and Central. T44, the rear half. And T44 off to Sydney Terminal. We got another Tangara making its way slowly through platform number two. Train will be stabling at Mortdale Maintenance Centre. Oh, it's T30. T30 was the ex Port Kembla service that I caught here. So this was, yeah, this was the one that was from the south coast. So yeah, it went up to Hurstville's terminate, turned it right back, and uh, yeah, now it's stabling in the Mortdale Maintenance Centre.
see, off it goes, off to be stabled. And we've got another Tangara heading off to reposition land in the Mortdale Maintenance Centre. We've got our last two services of the day, last two stopping services. First one is Cronulla in four minutes, stopping Janelli, Sutherland and all stations to Cronulla. And then on platform one, we'll have one more service going to Sydney Terminal, stopping Penzurst, Turstville, Walleye Creek, Redfern and Central. Central Sydney Terminal service arriving into platform one. Last service heading towards the city of the day, T95 the front half. Train will stop Penzurst, Hurst, Walleye Creek, Redfern and Central Sydney Terminal only. And uh, so we just saw our last city bound service of the day. This is our last southbound service, T54, front half on a Cronulla service. First stop Janelli, then Sutherland and all stations to Cronulla. After this, no trains will stop at Mortdale due to the industrial action. This is our last stopping service of the day. And it's a Cronulla service. And as you can see, a lot of people have taken advantage of it being the last train by piling onto it. But that's good because it means that they won't get stuck in the city. And that's it now. The doors have closed on the final service and it departs. And that's it.
All right, as you can see, that's it. Trains have shut up shop for the day at 7.03 p.m. But we do have an empty mover. Heading off to be stabled at Mortdale Maintenance Centre. There will still be a few of these move through. T20 rear half. So yep, that'll be heading over to stable at Mortdale Maintenance Centre as you can see, because train stations are closed. And this isn't just Mortdale or the Illawarra line, this is Sydney trains and New South Wales train link network wide. But I've just seen a very cool sight. The Kayama picnic train. Let's go get this. Good to see industrial action couldn't stop the Kiama picnic train from gracing the tracks. Lovely to see. Anyway guys, I'm going to wrap up the video here. So thanks so much for watching this episode of Sydney Trains on Location. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like, comment, favourite and share and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye for now.